There's been another extraordinary twist in the Lawyer X saga. The former judge deciding if criminal charges should be laid has called it quits, saying prosecutors won't press charges. Reporter Jesse Thompson joins us now. Jesse, what can you tell us about this latest development? Well, Tam, the special investigator looking into the Lawyer X scandal has lashed the state's director of public prosecutions for declining to proceed with charges against some of the key players involved in the scandal. Now, this goes back to a recent Royal Commission that led to the establishment of a special investigating body that was headed up by former High Court judge Geoffrey Nettle QC. His job was to determine whether there was enough evidence to bring criminal charges against some of the key people involved. But in a new report tabled in State Parliament today, he's essentially called it quits and called for his office to be abolished, saying that the Director of Public Prosecutions has repeatedly knocked back his recommendations for various charges. Now, in one example, we can see that his team spent almost a year pulling together a brief of evidence. He says that the Director of Public Prosecutions, Kerry Judd, then knocked that back, citing issues with the admissibility of evidence and whether one key witness would come forward uh, and lead to a successful prosecution. This stash between those two legal minds has then made its way all the way to the Attorney General, with Geoffrey Nettle QC complaining that he felt he essentially had zero chance of ever bringing a prosecution in relation to this scandal. In this report, he's written that after a great deal of reflection, he's concluded there's no point in his office persisting. He says it's a waste of people's time and scarce economic resources. So, Jesse, what's likely to happen now? Well, Sam, one of the key issues here really is the powers that this special investigating body has. The state opposition in Parliament today has been heaping pressure on the government to expand its powers and give it the right to directly charge people if the evidence is there. But Attorney General Jacqueline Symes has rejected that suggestion. She's told state Parliament that the body was set up according to the Royal Commission's recommendations and she's in no hurry to change it. I have no intention of bringing legislation to undermine um, that recommendation. The DPP has a role, she's performed that role, and I give no commentary in relation to uh, her view versus the Office of the Special Investigator. It's Attorney General Jacqueline Symes there. Now the, Department, the Director of Public Prosecution says they've read the report and they'll respond to it in due course, Tam.